a warm welcome to my youtube channel if this is the first time you're clicking on one of my videos my name is kate this is kate vlogs please consider subscribing make sure that you like this video give it a thumbs up and i know that it's going to be an educative video so in today's video i'm going to do shopping for a client so i'm shopping for bells shoe bells to be specific um and i'm going to uh buy cream bells cream bells so I want to show you the bells so that at least if you need them, you can talk to me. I deliver countrywide and I also deliver worldwide, as you know. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So these are what we call mitumba bells. So what is a mitumba bell? So um, when we talk about mitumba bells, we are talking about different types of second-hand clothes in the market. So these mitumba bells come from different countries. And the countries uh, include United States, Australia, China, UK. And these bells are classified into what we call grades. Bells are not the same. So we have cream bells, we have grade 1, and we have grade 2. I want you to understand the difference so that when I mention the prices, you will not be shocked. So before I give you the types of bells that exist in the market, I want you to understand that if this is a multi-billion industry that requires low capital to start and the profits are massive. Most people will prefer Mutumba products because of their good quality and people of different classes, uh, even if you come from a very rich family or the low class as we call them, everyone will prefer a Mutumba product, be it shoes, be it clothes, because one thing about Mutumba, they are unique and they are of good quality. For you to start a Mtumba business, you can decide to go to the market and select the clothes from the different sellers if you don't have enough money to buy a bill. But if you're in a position to raise the capital for buying a bill, I would advise you to do it because um, we have three different types of bells in the market. We have what we call cream bells, grade 1 or grade A bells, um, Mtumba bells. Then we have grade 2 or grade B Mtumba bells. So the first bell is called the cream bell. Cream, C-R-E-M-E. -E. Um, these are brand new uh, clothes or products. Every product that comes as a cream bell is brand new. These are products that have never been worn before. So the shoes are brand new, the clothes are brand new, the curtains are brand new. 100% of what is contained in our cream bell is of good quality. Everything, 100% of anything you get in a cream bell is sellable at 100% profit. So the second category is grade 1 or grade A bells. Mark that word. So these are affordable and they're still quality. 100% of them are not cream bells. Meaning that if you open a grade 1 bell, most of the clothes will be 90% almost new clothes because um, these are clothes that have just been worn a few times or shoes that have been uh, worn for a few times and then donated. They are are almost new but remember cream bells have never been worn uh, they compress things that have never been used but for grade one they were used for just a few times the way you can wear a cloth for maybe two times and then you feel I, I don't need this cloth that is what we call a grade one or a grade a bell so the third one is the grade two bell or what we call grade b bells um these are clothes that have been worn several times they are not very very good they are not pleasant to look at and they are not very very costly they are quite affordable however uh you can get a few pieces of camera when you open uh grade two bells that is, is what most people in gikomba will open for you in public so that you can choose what you love those are grade two bells now i want you to understand the prices Cream bell is very expensive according to what I, I want you to understand. Uh, when you compare with the three types, the cream bell is most expensive. You can get a cream bell costing 50,000 Kenyan shillings. But you are guaranteed that when you open that bell, you are going to get the best out of it. Everything will be in perfect condition. You will not even be having any trouble selling the products. And then lastly, if you open a grade 2 or what you call grade B Mutumba bells, it might not have the best. It has some clothes that are torn. It has some clothes that have uh, stains, such. So they are very, very affordable. And that is how, uh, that, that is what most of the people can afford. And that is what you can open as a beginner in the Mutumba industry. But my advice is, if you can afford a cream bill, 
it is really something that i will tell you to go for um let me give you an example of um, the ranges if you want to open a canvas cream bell for shoes for the kids um you can get it at 22,000 Kenyan shillings. Some people will sell it at 23. Depends on where you're going to buy it. But if you're not in a position to buy the cream belt, you can go for the second uh, type, the grade one belt, which will still have a good pair of shoes that will range 15,000 Kenyan shillings that way. So you are also uh, supposed to know the countries of origin and how they affect the types of bales. Because we have China, you have UK, you have US, Australia, UK. I don't know if I mentioned UK twice. But the bales will, uh, will also be determined by the countries of origin. Most of the China cream bales are very expensive, but they also have the best, best mtumba bales. Most clothes bell will contain um, quite some good number of clothes inside. You can get a bell with 300 pieces of clothes inside. And um, I would advise you to uh, do a thorough research on exactly how your market looks like, your target market, who do you want to sell to. If you want to sell to university students, you can start with jeans, bells. And um, if you want to target maybe um, a neighborhood, you can target mixed roomage where we have all kinds of clothes. Remember that trousers, kids' trousers, especially uh, cotton trousers, they really move fast. And something that you will never go wrong with is a cream bell. You can actually open a, um, a shop and uh, do shoes only. And you can make sure that you deal with only cream shoes cream bales of shoes you can uh, stock uh, what you call canvas sport shoes sneakers everything open shoes cream bales and you're going to get a lot of profit because assuming let me just give you an example a cream bell of canvas rubbers if you buy it at twenty one thousand, it contains 70 pairs of shoes that means that if you go and sell the 70 pairs of shoes at 500 shillings you're going to get 35,000 shillings meaning the profit is 14,000 in profit imagine so if you open two bills that will be 28,000 of profit i'm telling you shoes especially cream bills and even clothes cream bills are very very profitable if you're not in a position to start uh, this kind of business with bills you can still go to the market and also i do that at a fee i shop for you and i go to gikomba select the clothes for you at less than 50 shillings and then i send the parcels countrywide and make sure that i almost also do the deliveries um the same same day and you can uh, start uh, your Mtumba dream today. So I hope that you have uh, enjoyed watching this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. It really supports my channel. And also subscribe for more incredible, educative, inspiring, motivating videos. I'm going to see you on my next video. Bye. It's been a roller coaster, but you stayed And now I'm taking over for the day Cause I can be what you wanna be